Hi everybody! Did you know that we're celebrating a holiday this week? It's a really exciting new holiday that many people may not even know about and it's called Chinese New Year. I'm going to read a book today called Peppa's Chinese New Year. Peppa and George are at a playgroup. Good afternoon, children, says Madame Gazelle. Today is a lucky day. Is it my birthday? asks Danny Dog. <laughs> no, laughs Madame Gazelle. It's Chinese New Year. Look at all the pretty decorations. The children are excited. Before we celebrate Chinese New Year, we must sweep up, Madame Gazelle says. That is because we sweep out the old year before we welcome in the new year. Hee <laughs> hee Peppa and her friends love sweeping. Miss Rabbit brings in lots of paper lanterns. She is going to be a helper today. Chinese New Year is about family and good fortune, says Madame Gazelle. Let's celebrate together. Everybody cheers, hooray! Next, Peppa and her friends make Chinese New Year cards. Why are all the cards red, wonders Peppa. In China, red is a very lucky color, replies Madame Gazelle. My dress is red, squeals Peppa. That makes you extra lucky, says Madame Gazelle. Peppa promises to share her extra luck with Susie Sheep. Aww. Miss Rabbit brings out a tray of food. It has candy, tangerines, and cookies. Is anyone feeling hungry? Miss Rabbit asks. We are, shouts Pedro. I like Chinese New Year, says Danny, picking up two candies. Later, everyone gets dressed in red clothes just like Peppa. Then Madame Gazelle shows them pictures of China. This house is called a pagoda, she says. Repeat after me, pagoda, laughs George. To celebrate the new year, we will have a dragon dance, Madame Gazelle tells the children. Peppa is excited but she's also confused. Where is the dragon, Peppa asks. We're going to make it, says Madame Gazelle. Peppa and her friends get to work. They use cardboard and paint, ribbon, and their imagination to make the dragon. Who wants to carry the dragon, asks Madame Gazelle. Peppa? Pandora, Peggy, Richard, and George do. Roar, says Peppa, pretending to be a dragon. Roar, says Pandora, Peggy, and Richard. Look what a beautiful dragon they made. Next, Mr. Bull sets up the fireworks. The fireworks will light up the sky during the children's dragon dance. That gives Madame Gazelle an idea. Mr. Bull, would you like to lead the dance as a lion, she asks. I think it would be an honor, replies Mr. Bull. With everything ready to go, Mr. Bull leads the children outside for the dragon dance. Peppa is so excited she can't hardly wait. The children perform the dragon dance while the fireworks light up the sky. Pop, pop, pop! It truly is a sight to behold. And there's another sight too. 
the parents have come to see the show. Happy Chinese New Year, say the parents. The children smile. Happy Chinese New Year, they reply. The end. I hope you enjoyed that story learning about Chinese New Year, and I hope you can do the activities that we've listed in the links below. Don't forget to join us this Saturday, the 5th. We're having our drive-through Take Your Child to the Library Day event here from 1 to 2, and we can't wait to see you there. Bye, guys.